Standard human greetings, ladies, gentlemen, and all the configurations of being. My name is Captain Huey, and welcome back to Prison Architect. Uh, three months after my first episode, which was my first attempt at a single-player commentary. Um, but, you know, better late than never. For the, you know, like, four people that watched... The first episode, which I have renamed to episode zero, uh, we built this. Got a little administrative center over here. We got a big old cell block. We got a little entrance area over here. We got a canteen for our big cell blocks and a kitchen. And, and then I just now made this little plan over here, which we're just going to go ahead and... Uh, build for some solitary cells because apparently this guy over here needs some solitary. Um, we've got guards, we've got a yard with not much in it, which I suppose we should fix. But uh, regardless of that, um, I read and rewatched that episode because it has been three months, and if I remember correctly, I wanted to put some farms up here maybe. Uh, I wanted to do like a bakery and visitation over on this area and then everything else. Uh, we'll get around to it. I'm going to go ahead and one speed it for now. Um, while I figure out what I'm going to be doing in terms of building. Because I need a laundry, a cleaning cupboard... A common room. I need a lot of shit, essentially. I also need an infirmary. An infirmary would probably be a good idea. Um, we've also got, uh, you know, we've got Jim and Reginald. Well, we'll check up. We'll check up on them later, and then I'm gonna. What, are, what is your name gonna be? Your name shall be. I don't know. Maybe, maybe I'll leave that up to you. Anyone who watches this video, leave me a comment. What should we name? Let me, leave me some names for, like, all the different administrative people. Maybe we can even name some of the guards. Um, we've got... I'm just gonna open those doors, because they should be able to get into the canteen regardless of what daytime it is. Um... Are we intaking more prisoners? We probably should. We'll intake another 10. Uh, for the moment, we have everybody sitting in the same cell block because we don't have facilities for different ones. So I suppose, uh, you know, it's pr rather, rather quick of me, but uh, I am going to go ahead and shut up do some building, we'll time lapse it because I think it's rather fun actually to watch someone build something in a time lapse, especially in a game like this. So, yeah, I will see you uh, in a little bit. I told you, as soon as we got prisoners, we're going to get criminally insane. I should I should have just turned criminally insane off, to be honest with you. I hate having to build entirely new facilities for people, but they, they actually, like, they require... Well, they don't require padded cells, but it's better to put them in padded cells away from the other prisoners in, like, better cells... And that always has bothered me, because it's like, I don't want to have to do that. I don't want to have to make a whole other fucking cell block for that shit. And I usually never make enough. And I never import them, because I don't want to deal with them. Um, yeah, so this is solitary over here.
This room I've decided I think I'm going to make into secure, uh, just a big security room slash armory. Not that I really need a giant security room at the moment. Tracking monitor. Cried for tracking me. Operating operated by a guard inside security room monitor. Any prisoners wearing tracking belts? Hmm. Fascinating. Who who do we put tracking belts on? I should make a cleaning room. Uh, where is... And then we need to do a program to do... Solar panel development? Farm work safety. Um, requires a common room. Allows inmates and civilian delinquents to interact should have positive effect on both as long as inmates have either been trained or have current level of customer service experience to interact with these delinquents. Allows inmates to interact with civilians that have no relation to them. Can be a worry for many, as such this program teaches which actions are and are not okay whilst also increasing an inmate's customer service experience. The idea of this program is to change the mindset of the current incarcerate by having an ex-inmate who is now reformed to speak about their life experiences. I like a kitchen. More work time. Right. Uh... Let's see. This shall now be work time. Y'all don't get to work. Y'all just get free time. What is this? Uh, work slash lockup. Eat slash lockup. Insane skip readers was making more design. Or use other cuisines. Oh, after they finish eating, they're restricted. Hmm. I think I'm just going to give them a bunch of free time. And then this down here needs to be made into a yard. At least a big portion of it. This visitation is going to have um I think I have visitation booths, do I not? Yeah. We'll have visitation booths for the criminally insane. Those are. I assume a lot of this shit is just for like um, decoration. Like a lot of this stuff is just decoration, right? We got a whole bunch of bushes. We're gonna put a cat bush, and a deer bush, a dog bush, a T Rex. We're gonna do the same thing up here. Have a warden and a swan, a T Rex, a dog, a deer, a cat. There's also like 
there's just there's just so many rooms and shit that I need to build. And I really don't want to spend the time to build them, I'll be honest. Because we've already been going for 41 minutes and I've barely talked at all. Like, this whole fucking episode is going to be just a big old time lapse of me kind of building, but sometimes not building. And I don't know how to feel about that. We'll put a shower head in. A phone booth. And then we're gonna need to run the pipes down here. I should probably get canines up and running. Like I said though, it's better to have like small armories and small um staff rooms. Okay. Let's make a staff room. Because I think a staff room would do my entire prison worlds of good. Like this. This can be a staff room. We'll make this into a staff room. It's a little bit too... Well, 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 well. We'll make a staff room off of the kitchen. How about that? Do a quick planning. We'll put some walls in. We don't want it to be too, too big. We'll make it a 7 by 10. Clear off that. Putting a thing right there. This is too small. Nah. It'll be fine. Like, because realistically... I have a laundry. What should this be? I have a whole lot of shit I could put in here. I have a visitation room. Building a staff room. I have a shower. I could make a shop. I could make it parole room. I could make a mail room. A library. A gymnasium wouldn't be a bad call. Um, a common room. Cleaning. We should make a small cleaning room as well. Like, right over here. It will be like the size of a cell. And it'll have a staff door on it. Oh, that's just structure. That's why I can't find it. It'll have a staff door on it, and it'll be a cleaning room. And we should just throw up, I think we should throw up a fence, like here, we should throw up a fence, just because I want them to be able to access this area without having to make shit, make more stuff. It's part of the reason why I've been building like this. Um, then I can just throw a door down and they can't get anywhere. Um, I should also probably set up the farms. That could be a good little source of income. Um, and reforming prisoners is actually a really good source of income. Is there a small serving table? We'll put down another small serving table. Then we'll put up a drinks machine and a tray dispenser. We'll put down a bin over in the corner over here, and then we're just gonna give these guys a bunch of dining booths. Because they're criminally insane, and giving them nice things is, like, the way to do it. From my personal experience, anyway. I 
I really want this to be a priority. Can we prioritize this, please? I really want you to build that because then I can make a staff room. We're going to do a quick shakedown. There's a shit ton of places to look. We're going to intake a couple more prisoners. Should probably have a guard in here. How about a guard in here? I have a guard out here. This should have a door on it. I'll put a, like a solitary door. Um, what else? Um, hmm, 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 hmm. All right. Well, they have a shower head in their rooms. So I don't think we'll need to do... Well, let's just do this. And it would be over on this side. Just bring the pipe down and over like this. Too many prisoners have access to narcotics. Hire dog handlers. We don't have dog handlers researched, I don't think. Probably finish off getting a bunch of this shit. Um, land expansion would be bad. Uh, total saving of 3,000 taxes per 10,000 of daily profit. I'll do that. We need dogs, CCTV cameras, tasers, body armor. You know, I think I turned off fail conditions. Because, fuck fail conditions. Um, hire new staff. Let's get another janitor. I do need to build a kennel and an armory, though. So let's build a kennel and an armory. Let's just build off of this building here. Get rid of the wall. And then we can do, like... We'll have a door here. And a door down here. And then we'll have most of this, like half of it, be our main armory, and then part of it will be, this one, two, part of it will be, um, the kennel. Yeah. So we'll have, like, the kennel in here, we'll have a big armory in here. Uh, this needs to be a staff room. There needs to be more doors on this, I think. We'll put a door out this way. Put a door in every direction. We'll go ahead and throw a room in here. Oh. Equipping some of your mischievous prisoners with tracking belts who can track them to the security room. I don't know how that works. So, I'm gonna ignore it for the time being. The training room, staff members, uh, staff room, this one. Is it big enough? It is big enough. The sofa, and a sofa. We're down a couple drinks machines. One of these. Can we fit a rose in? Put a single chair down. You want to treat your staff with the best, because your staff, you know. They are, after all, doing doing the work. Alright, once this is done, we can throw one down here as well. And then... 
We should build more uh, of this. We should first off get rid of this. We don't need it. And then we should build some wind turbines. Why can't we put them so close together? This doesn't feel safe. Yeah, because we need more power to actually charge the batteries to get through the night over here. Um, this is supposed to be a first thing to get the light some power, and then we'll make it into a cleaning room. This is cleaning room. I mean, the more cleaning rooms you have, the more prisoners you can assign to it, and the bigger they are, the more you can assign to it. There's three qualified prisoners here. 20 here. Yeah, crop distribution. Laundry services. That's that's what I was going to put down here. So down here, this big room here, was for... Let me guess. Oh, we haven't finished putting all the... Okay. So this was for all of like the extra shit I needed to put down here. How big, how small can a, um, infirmary be? So I think we should put, because we're going to need a, we've got some solitary cells. There's not much you need for your criminally insane. I mean, we're going to need a laundry. So we'll make that like a, a six by six. Put a wall down. We need an infirmary. Make that a six by six. Uh, what else would be good for them? I don't know. A common room would probably be pretty all right. Like that. What if I take off? If I take off one, like that, then we can use our clone tool to grab this and put in some offices down here. Well, uh, well, I guess we can do this. Right. It's gonna be like a one wide hallway, which I'm not a huge fan of because we can't put CCTV in them. Well, we can, but it won't be very effective. How big does this need to be? How big does this need to be? Technically speaking, we can reduce them a one more. And then we'll put the walls down. Staff door on the infirmary and staff door on the laundry, and then we will put like three of those in. Uh, need another wall. Does this mean that my workers have actually caught up on everything? They have. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna slow it down then and do more big building. Um, I guess when they're actually, you know, able to work because they've gotten some rest. A health monitor. Required for tracking me. Keep track of inmates' health and stats if they are equipped with a tracking belt. I guess I'll make one of those. And put a medical box down. 
one of those. We'll put a couple laundry baskets in. Ironing board. Put a table in and we'll put the laundry baskets like here. Suppose we could do a small table. Do a small table. And like another ironing board. Then we're gonna need water in here. We need to equip this kitchen with some stuff. Can I put two in? I can't put two in. Put down a sprinkler. Ooh, we can make tall fridges actually. I don't know when we got the ability to do that. Oh, we can't. Recycling bin and a normal bin. And then power supply should be good. Water supply, we need water this way. What about a common room? A bench in, we'll put a pool table in. We'll throw down two TVs. We'll throw down a Painting. I'll put down a sofa, we'll put down some chairs, there we go, and these offices down here are going to be for, very specifically, psychiatrists, uh, apparently he claimed one of the offices up here. Did he claim one down here now? No. This office is ready and raring to go. Why aren't you claiming it? Did you claim a different one? I think I have any up here for you. Uh, let's see. What did I want down here? A kennel. And we want an infirmary. Or an armory, rather. I think your guards need a little more shock power. It can enable prison polity that equip them with stun batons. Stun batons? That seems excessive. I mean, only a little bit excessive, but excessive nonetheless. Alright, let's throw down some dog cages. This is, this is just going to be our only kennel. And then, as for an armory, we need... I'll put down two weapons racks. The main thing you want out of an armory is your guard lockers, because that would, that's what allows you to make more... Armed guards? Armed guards are pretty good. I dare say they can be a bit of a liability, though, because if they get taken down by, like, a gang leader, they just take the shotgun out of their hands, and, um, then they go on a rampage, and it's quite the spectacle. I have lost upwards of 20 prisoners to riots that, where they get shotguns. Um, it's not pretty. I'll just say that. It's not, it's not pretty. Um, you need pipes. Alright. 
Um, I think that's that's pretty good progress today, right? We made an infirmary. We did all this stuff. Um, cannot be mixed with standard power. What's going on? I don't think it's mixed with standard power, is it? Because these are too close. I'm wondering if it's because these are like touching the power supply without... How about now? We good? Yeah, I think we're good. We don't actually need to move these. We do need to connect this one, though. I guess, really, what we need to do is move this over a little bit. I'm going to get rid of the power over here for just a sec. And then now we can also make solar wind hybrids, which are pretty good. They're really expensive from what I remember, but still pretty good. Yeah, we spent $25,000 on solar panels. Um, but that's okay. Like that. And then... That should be good, right? We good? Workers, what you working on right now? Carrying shit. Uh, we do need to make... How many criminally insane prisoners do we have? can't imagine we've got too many, right? Got four? Jesus Christ. Okay. We need to do a couple of... Breathe programs. Okay. Um, let's see, let's see, let's see. We need... Psych... Yes, this one. But we also need to add a sofa down in here. So that it will actually work. So I suppose we'll do brown sofas. There we go. Brown sofas. We got we got a criminally insane wing set up for the most part. We got an infirmary, laundry. We don't really have anything for them to do. Do. Um, but I think that'll be fine. Put down like a small table and a small bench. Down some radios and a boom box. And some bleachers for some reason. And one of these things. And some gym mats somewhere. Alright. That should be good. I think. Um, we can have 57 prisoners. I wish I could look. Is there a way I can like look and see um hmm. um I want to know how many normal cells I have versus padded cells actually hang on can I just look at that in the rooms I have 8 padded cells and 49 normal cells so I can have 
how many normal prisoners do I have? Um, 16. So what's 49 minus 16? Let me, let me look quickly grab me old calculator because I'm terrible at mental math. 16, 33, so I can have 33 more prisoners. So I think I'm going to accept 15 more prisoners. And then we are going to do... So we're, we're currently positive in yield cash flow. Which is good. Um... We're not making enough power for all of this. That's okay, though. I don't know what to make this. Because this is an infirmary. Cause I, normally I have my common rooms, like, in here, right? Like, we can put a common room in here. Just have a big old common room. And then we can throw like benches down, we can have a couple of pool tables, we can have a couple of TVs for the benches, we'll have a couple of radios, put down a painting or two, put down a sofa. Right, down a sofa for listening to the radio. We should put down a whole bunch of chairs because then we can do the programs that require the chairs. And we'll have the painting. There, that's nice. That's a nice little common room. I don't know what to make this. Do I make it? I could make it a chapel, I could make it a gym room, I could make it a fighting room. Um, we could do a library, a mail room, a meeting room. I think a library. Well, let's do a mail room. Well, that that really exacerbates mail rooms. Really, really exacerbate. Um, like, what's the word? Contraband. Like, they really exacerbate contraband. Um, but I think it will probably be fine. Because we can throw... Do I have to do a big table? I don't want to do a big table. Um, I guess we'll do a big table. We'll just have four sorting desks uh, for the logistics. It's labor management. Menu provides you control of the inmates allowed to work here, the labor times, along with quick guard deployment options. So, like... Highest security level. Medium security, I guess. Work and work lockup. Cell quality is abysmal. But I don't care. Prison labor. Um, I do want to deploy. I should make a patrol route. It's like. I just want to make it go around, like, what we have so far, and then we'll put a dog on it to sniff for, uh, tunnels. The main areas you want this is, like, around the cells, right? We only got the one dog handler at the moment. Um, but for deployment, I would like, I'd like an armed guard in here, and I'd like an armed guard down here. And I'd like a dog handler in here. We want one cook, 
per kitchen at the very least and one doctor per infirmary. And then we probably want a guard in the shower and here. So we've got five posted, we only have ten guards. Uh, because we're going to be getting more prisoners tomorrow, I am going to go ahead and preemptively hire like, three more guards. We haven't built this yet. Um, I, I'm going to hire like two more of these. We'll get one more janitor and one more gardener. Um, and then, yeah. And we'll do we'll do a shakedown. Well, a nightly shakedown. Can we do a nightly shakedown? No. Custom schedule, right? I want to do all sectors every three days at like one p.m., twelve p.m. All right. And then we'll do, like, guard investigation. We'll do a tunnel search every five days at 12 a.m. And then we'll do a narcotic search all sectors every three days. That works. That works. That, that's good. Good, good, good. Good, good. Um, yeah. Uh, I will go ahead and initiate a shakedown because um, it's like my. One prisoner is up for parole. Yeah, my, my workers are busy. They are busy trying to build everything. What's going on down here? Guards. I turn our door on this. I need, I need, I need, I need guard response down here. Starving. Get him some food, lads. Um. We're chewing through our cash right now. Cancel this shakedown. We'll cancel that shakedown because we just did one. Um, why do I not have research? Uh, fifty thousand is a lot. I don't even need most of this. The bank loan, I guess. Um, right, logistics. Canteening. Right. Okay. Alright. This has gone on far too long, and it hasn't been all that interesting, and I apologize for that. Um, next episode, I hope, will be a little bit more interesting. I'll try to think up some, like, story bits. 
we'll try to make a little story out of this, and we'll try to, um, yeah, we'll, we'll look at some prisoners, it'll be a good time, I hope, anyway, uh, but, uh, I mean, before I forget, I'm gonna hire some of my armed guards, and then we're gonna intake more prisoners, um, but yeah, Thank you everybody for watching. Uh, I hope you enjoyed. I I I I I quite like this game. It's a little overwhelming at times, but I think it'll be fine. Um, we'll we'll get we'll get we'll get there. Um, for now, though, I'll see you next time.